Hey guys, Augie Saint here, coming some more Lost Ark, and today I want to talk to you guys about Wandering Merchants. What they are, where you get them all, and more, most importantly why you should be doing them. But what I think the most important part is actually easy ways to find them, and I do have multiple sources for you guys in this video. We have a website, Lost Merchants, and then we have another thing for Discord called Saint Bot. If you guys have heard about that, it's really great trackers. You can actually set your role specifically to what you want to track on which merchant and, and then it will just ping you every time they spawn and with what they spawn. So if you're looking for something specific. Now mainly what we use the Wandering Merchants for is going to be legendary rapport items or just rapport items in general because they just cost silver and then cards as well. Cards is probably the biggest thing for most people is trying to build and finish off your card deck. So let me show you guys a Wandering Merchant in game right now. There's one up that spawned over here. And this is more or less what that thing looks like and over here is um this is the thing that i actually came in and i said this one because i want this legendary report item so eighty thousand silver for a legendary report item in my books i would spend that eighty thousand silver all the time you can only buy one at a time because this will be 18 minutes until you, your hold limit resets but in 18 minutes this guy will be gone so you have a day in 13 minutes until the sale ends and this guy moves to a different location or a new set of merchants actually starts spawning then. I do have a lot of stuff that I'll show you guys how to track this all, but that's just mainly what you're using them for is report and then cards. They have lots of cards, legendary cards as well. There's a lot of good ones. There's way all kinds of good cards that you will need eventually. So what I can suggest to you right now is start working on these. And with all these websites and information I'm about to share with you in this video, it'll be extremely easy to track all of them. I myself have been neglecting them and I have not really been doing them. Since, it, uh, since I started playing last dark, but recently I found out how easy it is to actually track them all and I've started working on my card deck. So let's go over here. Card catalog, you can see I'm starting to fill mine. I've got 238 out of 240. That is just how many I can have right now. That's not how many there is in total. I think there's like 302 or 300. There's definitely over 300 cards. Just have to expand your slots and go up over there. So I can only hold 240 at the moment. But anyway, that and then report as well. I've started working on report with everybody, so I need all of these report items. So let's hop straight into the resources I'm talking about. Let me pull this up for you guys. So for starters, we do have a max roll guide for you guys. All of this will be linked down in the description below, so don't worry, you can access all of this pretty easily. Now, if you want to go through here, and this will just show you, this will explain everything to you about Wandering Merchants. It will show you their schedule, what times, AM, PM, their areas, Lucas, the names of them all, where they all spawn and just everything this is really informative so if you want to go read up about every single thing you don't need to but just if you are interested you can go and learn about all of this stuff yeah and there is the two different trading ships which is pretty much like wandering uh wandering merchants but for ships out in the ocean there's two of them that actually rotate as well wandering merchant ships appear randomly at one of several islands every hour or 30 minutes so those two as well and then over here will tell you the name of the wandering merchants the area, Rithromus, and then the report stuff that I see there. Most of them have a legendary report, and a lot of them have good cards as well. So let's see any cards yeah, that we can see off by heart that I know that you need. That one's over there. Cooking ingredients as well is another thing that you will need from these. Because some of these cooking ingredients you use to make some of the cooking stuff to finish off your adventures tome. So if you come back in game real quick and we go to adventures tome. See this cooking stuff yeah mostly the legendary ones or something else you will need something from a wandering merchant to actually cook it up i don't know if this guy i think this guy does have one for an example yeah there's one over there counteraster it's a key ingredient in the boosting fluid soup so you will need this to make the soup if you do if you are yeah you might as well buy one i already have one and then chuck it in your bank just for later so you can do that and then let's go back to our max roll so you can go through there, it shows you exactly what everybody got. The way card, there we go. Probably the one that most people are trying to get will be from Mac in Annika. And she does have uh, two of these report items, one legendary, and then the way card, which a lot of people are trying to get to finish off the, the uh, set. I think it's part of the crit set. And as we go through here, you can see there's there's a lot of information here with everything. And there's the two uh, ships that, the wandering ships. One of them has a masterpiece, so you want to go and get that. It's 10,000 pirate coins, so just make sure you got 10,000 coins handy on you. So anyway, that is all the information about the Wandering Merchants. Now we're going to actually get into how you find them. So for this, I have this great website called Lost Merchants. And now you can actually enable notifications for this. So you will get pings and push notifications. Because when you come into the site, you will have to allow it to use cookies and notifications. 
And if you if you can't click it on over there, just click over here for help and it'll actually take you through how to set it up properly. You might have to disable an ad block or something like that just for this site. But how this site works is here it shows you active members, gives you their name. So if you have the name over there and you're looking for something specific, you can go back to this one over here, actually go through the names and look for what you're trying to get specifically. And then just remember the name or write it down. It shows you how long they're there for, what zone. And if you actually scroll over the zone, it shows you exactly where they are. As we see down there on the map, it gives you a little circle. These sometimes do take a few seconds or minutes to update. So for example, see this one appears the next appearance in 44 minutes. So when Ben actually pops up in the top here, just give it a few seconds, like up until about a minute or two before this actually pops up, just because people actually need to find it and then ping back to the website. But it's relatively fast. You will definitely make it with them more than enough time. They will pop up where exactly they are, what they have. And on this website, they normally just show you the cards that there is and the report. So you don't even have to go and memorize them over on the Maxroll site because you just read them over here. See, for example, I went through there, no cards that I wanted because I'm only looking for way over here. And then report, I just seen, oh, there's a legendary one right there, Arid Path, and there it is right there. So I went over and got it in Arid Path. And you can actually vote it and whatever you want over there. But this website really good to just, as soon as you come log into Lost Ark, pop it open, see what's going on. See when the next ones if there's nothing you like from them to see when the next one shows up in 40 minutes then you know okay 40 minutes check it again and then we do have the saint bot now there's the link i will leave this in the description down for you guys as well you can actually just i think click add bot and then it adds it and then the bot will actually dm you directly or you can integrate it into a discord channel which i actually do have i uh, spent quite a while this afternoon doing it for myself in my uh, discord channel i will leave my discord down below for you guys this is also the best way to get in contact with me to ask me questions on lost Ark. it is pretty small right now i'm still trying to build it up so come on over and join the discord i'd really appreciate you guys and we can start up our community there and i'll add up to the discord and add all different channels and everything and get this going better but basically you can have this ping you i've set it up in the lost arc saint pot part in our discord and we'll just show you what the uh, the name of everything so lucas spawned 18 minutes ago the item he's got no good items those are his potential items and then this is just the location udia salad hills so if you want to get alerts on specific ones when you're actually in the same same bot uh, discord channel i actually left it earlier because i set it up on mine now but when you are in there it will actually show you all the roles you can choose so you can choose different servers and whatever you're trying to get so if you're only going for specific things we'll only show you that how I have it set up for my Saint Bot of Yeah is all the Carter stuff since we are in Carter. That is our server on NA East. We have Saint Bot at Carter, but you can set this up to be any any zone, any server, anywhere. Saint Bot's really good. So add that to your Discord. Come join my Discord. Join on up and I'll fix this up so we can actually get it set to all different roles and all different servers for you guys. Anyway, that's most of that is to this. So just watch those timers come in game get yourself some legendary cards get yourself some legendary report items and start working on all of those reports and your card deck i hope this helped and if you guys could please drop a sub and a like it really helps me out so much and i'll catch you guys in the next one hope you out run free and dive into the sky Hear the